My name is Carmen Rice. In 2004, I began to have headaches, feeling dizzy, and nauseated. My headaches gradually got worse, so bad I could not stand them. I was having lunch at a local restaurant when I had a seizure. All I remember is waking up in the hospital. The next day, I had an MRI. That evening, my doctor called and told me that I had a brain tumor. She said that because I caught it so early and it was so small that I may have a chance of survival. I cried a lot. I could not believe this. How would I ever make it through? I was immediately scheduled for brain surgery. After my brain surgery, my tumor was sent to be diagnosed. It came back as a glioblastoma, the most aggressive form of a brain tumor. My doctor told me I had six months, three good, three bad. I did not know if I would live. I was just crying again. I started radiation. My radiation was the heaviest dose of radiation anyone could tolerate. My doctors believed in going in there and burning it out with everything you've got. I had it every day, Monday through Friday, at 1.30. I had a standing appointment. It made me very tired, very tired. After all my radiation treatments, I started chemo. My chemo that I took was called Temidor. I took, took it one pill a day for five days. Then I was off cycle for 28. It was a continual treatment. It made me very sick and nauseated. What I would do is take the nausea pill two hours before I took the chemo. I would take the chemo and then I would go to bed, hoping that if I was asleep, I wouldn't feel it quite so much. Everything was going well. I had MRIs every three months and then every six months. But in 2008, they found new growth, new growth in the same area. I was immediately scheduled for my second brain surgery. Again, I was in shock. I could not believe it. My second brain surgery was harder than the first. I was in rehab for two weeks. I had a difficult time walking. It was very difficult. I immediately started chemo. My chemo, once again, was Temidor. And I also took a Vastin. I was blown up like a balloon. I was on steroids to keep the swelling down in my brain. I was blown up. I was quite a sight. My second brain surgery, my tumor came back not malignant and my doctors could not believe it. I call this my miracle, my miracle from God who held my hand, who carried me through. I had two end dates and I'm still here. Yay! I had my last MRI in March of 2013. It came back, no new growth. No new growth. Again, it's a miracle. I hope that my story will be a, a help to those going through what I have been through. Keep your family close. Join a support group and never, never give up. I'd like to thank the National Foundation for Cancer Research for their continued 
work. I know that one day they will find a cure for glioblastoma.